Hi and welcome back to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang and in this video, I'm going to show you Gadgeteer, a new game for the Oculus Quest. And I can tell you already, I love this game and I want you to buy it because it's just friggin' amazing. So Gadgeteer, it has been available for the Rift and for SteamVR for quite a while and I love that game there already, but since today, it is available for the Oculus Quest and I so want you to see it in this video and then, yeah, it's a big recommendation, so simply get it. Before we start with showing you the gameplay footage, let me tell you what this is all about. Well, this is still MRTV, but since this season, I'm also going to show you games. Yes, not only hardware, I also want to show you more games. So, season three of MRTV, a blast. Now, this series, I'm going to call it new on Oculus Quest and well, I'm going to show you new Oculus Quest games. Does this mean that I will only show you Oculus Quest games here? No, I will also show you other games on other platforms. If I see something noteworthy, then it's going to be called new on SteamVR, for example. But for the moment, I'm really in love with the Oculus Quest and therefore I'm going to show you mostly new Oculus Quest games. So if you got the Quest, if you want to be informed about the latest games, why don't you subscribe to this channel and click on the bell button so you don't miss anything. But now let's have a look at Gadgeteer for the Oculus Quest. And here we are in Gadgeteer for the Oculus Quest. Now, what is this all about? Well, it's about chain reactions and parkours that you build to make these chain reactions happen. And as I learned, these things are called Rube Goldberg machines. I didn't know that before, but thanks to this game, I know it. So what I'm doing here right now, I'm using the clone tool to clone these pieces and yeah, put them in order so that this happens, a chain reaction. Yes chain reaction that reaches the goal and there was the very first level still simple but already very much fun and you know now what this is all about yeah so at the beginning at the beginning stages you only have these dominoes at your disposal right but later you will also have other things that you will yeah put into a certain order and that you will put onto the desk and make really cool chain reactions happen. What I really love about this game is how easy everything is controlled. Everything feels just right, it's very intuitive and yeah, it's simply fun to place those things onto the table. And here, for example, if you want to delete something, you can easily do so with the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> very well done. This game just feels right in VR. This is like a perfect game for virtual reality because you know, this kind of game, I really wouldn't want to play it on a 2D screen. It would be completely cumbersome to play this with a mouse, for example, but here really being able to put those pieces into place to change the angle, for example, it's just perfect. It's perfectly suited for VR and it's even better <laughs> here now with the quest because now finally I can play this anywhere. I love that this is finally on the quest and I can totally see myself playing this on the train, on the airplane or wherever I am. It's so cool. So for getting around in the game, you would simply click on the grip button and then you kind of hold the world and then you can yeah, change the position of the world and therefore move around and that works perfectly well. If you press on both grip buttons, then you can rotate the world around you. So controls are really tight, controls are wonderful and it's a one big part why I love this game so much. Then of course, you can always try your chain reactions and if they don't work, no problem. By a click of a button, everything will be back to square one and you can change 
some things again and then you can try it again. So now I'm close to the goal and the big moment of truth. Will it work? We'll see now. No. Okay. So this part I have to change its position a bit. Yeah, not with the clone tool. That was wrong. I have to use this tool here. And I have to put it a bit back. So now, now it should work. And? Yes. So this moment, the moment of truth, when you click on that green button, it is just, yeah, it's so satisfying. If it works, of course. And if it doesn't work, well, no problem. Change it up a bit and go again. I think people will spend lots of time in this title. And I'm really happy that I can show it to you now. And I really hope that you support the developers of this game. Because I want more games like this. I want more ingenious games like this. It's just so relaxing. It's just so fun and just so good. Okay, in this level, I would like to try something. I would like to have one of these domino pieces slide down this slope. <laughs> okay, let me show you what I mean. Here, this slope here. And I would like it to go down here and then I would like to go to the goal, of course. And here we are. So, do you think this will work? The moment of truth again. Let's click on that green button. Oh, perfect. Just as planned. Really nice. Yeah, and this was only the fourth level. Later it gets so interesting with little metal balls that have to run through different kind of courses. It's just nice. But I believe that in these 10 minutes of this video, you'll get a good idea of what this is about. By the way, how do you like this format? How do you like me playing games, showing them to you in around 10 minutes, gameplay being edited? So I wouldn't show you like 30 minutes of gameplay, but I would like to condense it into 10 minutes and then simply tell you what I thought about it in a voiceover like I do now. So please do let me know in the comment section below if you appreciate this format, if you like this format and if you want to see more. At the moment, this is what I want to do around 10 minutes of condensed gameplay, giving you an idea and most importantly, giving you my opinion about the game. And again, for this game, I really want you to buy it. It costs $14.99 and it's available since today, since 24th of October 2019 for the quest. So why don't you head over to the store, support the developers. This game is amazing and you will have so much fun if you love chain reactions and well, who doesn't love chain reactions, right? I hope you get a good idea now what Gadgeteer is all about. I really love it and I'm looking forward to play it more with my quest wherever I go. So at the end of this video, I would like to say thank you to all my Patreons who support this channel and who make this happen. So if you want to support this channel as well and get more videos and more information, then simply go to mrtvelite.com and for $3, you simply become part of this channel and yeah, get lots of additional content. Also, I would like to say a big thank you to the three MRTV champions who are Modicap, who make these amazing modifications like the Quest Sound Kit, really cool. Then VR Cover, you know them for all the amazing hygiene solutions and Human Eyes, makers of the Views XR camera. Thank you so much. All right, now at the end of this video, if you enjoyed it, why don't you give it a thumbs up Thumbs up for games on this channel. And if you have not yet subscribed to MRTV yet, why don't you do it now? And I'm looking forward to see you in the next video.